In Horn Elm, New York, at least 10 nursing home residents have died of COVID-19. Governor Andrew Cuomo first hearing about the COVID-19 crisis in Hornell area nursing homes on Thursday. We have hundreds and hundreds of nursing homes in this state, so I don't know of what has happened in every nursing home in the state. I don't have uh, firsthand knowledge of what happened with the nursing homes in Hornell, New York. The majority of Steuben County's coronavirus related deaths have been at a nursing home in the Hornell area, the county's coronavirus epicenter. Hornell Gardens has had at least six confirmed deaths related to the virus. The nursing facility is now in the process of moving 20 residents who tested negative for the virus to a facility in Waterloo. Hornell's mayor says he believes this plan is best to protect residents. As mayor, I don't have any direct authority over nursing homes. You can you can bet your last dollar I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna have a seat at the table and express my concerns and advocate for them. You know, if you can't visit, you should be at least be able to talk on the phone to them. But there are still about 26 residents at Hornell Gardens who have tested positive for the virus, as well as over 20 employees who are positive as well. Those employees and their loved ones have been calling for help, fearing that if they don't go to work, they will lose their jobs. I've had people reach out to me directly. Um, you know, either they're employees or friends or relatives of employees who work there expressing those concerns. It, you know, and my, and my heart breaks for these folks. If employees start showing symptoms, then they must quarantine themselves. Mayor Buckley says it is up to both the management of the facility and officials with the Department of Health to find people to care for the residents.